This is Jen Judkins with Teaching Forward. In this tutorial video, we'll show you how to create a quiz collaboratively using Google Sheets and a free website called Flippity.net. In this video, we'll show you how to download the Flippity.net quiz template into Google Sheets, and then how to edit that sheet to change the categories and for students to add questions and answers. Finally, we'll show you how to publish the quiz to the web and then play Flippity with your class. Let's get started. Navigate to Flippity.net and click on the Quiz Show option on the site. You can access this directly by going to Flippity.net slash quizshow.asp and this will let you see what the final quiz will look like. You'll see that in the screen right here, similar to a Jeopardy style quiz, and it'll even let you play a demo if you want to test it out. To make your own quiz, you choose the link to copy the template right here under step one. And it will allow you to make a copy of the template and open that into your Google Drive. You're going to want to rename the template so that it is something you can find again. And then a couple things to note, you do not want to change the first column or the first row. So the things that are labeled in blue cannot be changed. You can change in gray the titles of the categories. So what you'll want to do is change the category titles to represent the um, areas that you want your students to focus their quiz topics on. And you cannot add any more rows or columns. So you'll see that each category, there are five categories, oh sorry, six categories and five levels of questions for a total of 30 questions. And each question has both a question and an answer. So ideally, you will be having students create this quiz. It's a great activity to do for kids to review. So to have the students access the quiz, you're going to need to share it with them. The easiest way to do this would be through Google Classroom. If you're a Classroom user, you could distribute this document that you've now saved to your drive to your whole class so that anyone in the class can edit the same document because you could have a whole class create and work on the same quiz simultaneously by simply assigning groups of students to categories. Let's take a look at one that I've populated. Once you've completed your quiz with all the questions and the answers, you need to publish it to the web so that it can be played on Flippity. Click File, Publish to Web, choose Publish, and you're going to need to copy this link. Next, you need to click on the second tab that's in the spreadsheet. It says Get Link Here. Choose that tab. And in the third row, right under here where it says go to file, publish, and put the link below, you're going to paste the link in here. And you notice when I do that, a new option appeared. It says click to go to your Flippity Quiz Show. So I'm going to select that and choose the link that appears. And this brings me to my Flippity Quiz Show. So that all I need to do is click on a question. It gives my question. If I click it a second time, it gives the answer. And whatever teams score correctly or, or answer correctly, I can indicate those. And whoever does not, I can do the same. And then I can go back. You'll notice that question is gone and the team points have been calculated. And that is how you create a quiz game with your students using Google Sheets and Flippity. Thanks for watching. For this and other tutorial videos, check us out online at teachingforward.net.